Hey everyone, it's Hayes, and they've just released a brand new synopsis for The Awakening movie, which is <laughs> wonderful because honestly, I don't understand what's going on in any of the trailers we've seen. The only reason I'm laughing is just because, you know, it's just been one of those days where just, yeah, <laughs> everything just comes out all at once. <laughs> but against all the odds, I've actually managed to get more PhD work done today. Than I had planned on doing, but no one cares about that, myself included, so let's read the synopsis together. So, Marinette is a clumsy teenager struggling to get through school in Paris. The highlights of her day are when she sees her crush, Adrian. One day, Marinette finds a miraculous and miraculously transforms into the superhero Ladybug. Ladybug must learn to control her new superpowers, but the charismatic, also slightly arrogant, superhero Cat Noir helps her. What Marinette doesn't know is that Adrian is hiding behind Cat Noir's mask. When an evil mega villain with dark magic threatens Paris, Ladybug and Cat Noir must join forces. To save the city, the two embark on a daring mission that will take them from the catacombs of the city to the breathtaking heights of the Eiffel Tower. So I don't particularly feel like this explains anything more from the trailers. Like there was so much in those trailers. Like this film looks like it's going to be absolutely jam packed. The whole way through, I am I'm expecting it to be like a full on roller coaster ride with the sheer amount that was in those two trailers we got. But it definitely seems, and I think this was really communicated in the trailers as well, that Ladybug and Cat Noir are going to be a lot more separate. So, like in the show from the start, they've always been a team. Even without having to like communicate about the miraculouses, they've just worked together immediately. Whereas in the film, it doesn't seem so much. Like, it seems like Ladybug's going to be in charge, but Canmore, like I said, he does come across as kind of arrogant. I don't mean it in a bad way, though. I think it comes across as kind of in a nice way, not a rude and arrogant way. A nice and <laughs> arrogant way. Is that possible? I don't know. Obviously it is, since they've done it. But it does, like I said, kind of look like... Ladybug and Cat Noir definitely at first aren't going to be working very well together as a team, which I think is kind of uh, part of the message of the team. Like if you've seen some of the promotional posters, it's like super alone, unstoppable together, something like that. So it really seems that teamwork is going to be a massive message of the film. And the other major thing in the synopsis is about the evil mega villain with the dark magic. I'm assuming that of course refers to Hawk Daddy, um, I guess I'm just a bit like, he just seems like in the trailers, like don't get me wrong, I know Gabriel's horrible in the show, but Gabriel in the film, he just seems like he's been like absolutely corrupted or something by the Butterfly Miraculous and has just gone absolutely insane. Like he's not holding back. Like he gradually in the show progresses up to someone who's quite evil, because I would say in season five, he is pretty evil. Um, but like in season one, like he was still bad, but he wasn't as bad as he is now. Whereas in the film, it's just like Gabriel's like, no, forget this. Evil from the immediate word go. <laughs> but anyway, besties, I'd love to know what you think of the synopsis and I'll see you in the next one.